Hey guys, this is Andy and welcome to my channel. This is the first video my father filmed by himself and it is of him making a scrap metal sculpture. This particular art piece is featured in our short documentary Junkin, which will be released on this channel very soon. Okay, here we are. Mike at Reclaimed Art. Starting a new project here, and I got some pieces picked out. Kind of got a vision in my mind, but um, I can't tell you what it is because I'm not sure exactly what it's going to be. But I'm going to cut these off and use these and mount them to here. I'm going to drill some holes so this goes onto this plate, and then I'm going to use that gear and uh, possibly some other springs and just start creating something, and then um, I'm going to go from there. We'll see what it turns out to be. I can't tell you what I'm making because um, I'm not really sure myself. Okay, what I got here is um, kind of a start of whatever this is going to be. I'm going to try to make some sort of legs for here and then uh, something to go over the back. I don't know what's gonna happen after that, but um, I'm gonna give it a try. Cut a few more pieces and start making some sort of feet and legs. This is uh, where I'm at on my project here. This is where I'm making like legs here. I got uh, another one that I'm working on. I gotta rework it a little bit and raise it up. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do from there. It's gonna be some sort of a creature of some sort. But this is where I'm at right now. Okay, this is where I'm at with this uh, creature that I'm making. I got the back legs. These are gonna be the front legs. And then I'm gonna attach these on top of here for like a back or something. I'm gonna put some over the front too. That'll be sort of a body type thing. So that's where I'm at right now. Making progress here. I got the back legs on now. I found these uh, hinges that my son left around here. I moved them probably 30 times, but now they're permanent. So I use these and then I'm kind of trying to make like a body here. And then um, I'm gonna go from there, maybe put some sort of a head. So right now I gotta do a bunch of welding. Flipped it over and got it welded. Before I get too far, it's turning a little heavier than what I thought. Kind of like the way it's turning out. I'm gonna take uh, and fasten this on here, and then I'm gonna build off of this. And I might put some springs on it and see what happens. That's where I'm at right now. I got it on the ground with the engine hoist and I'm building these wings. And I got one started. I started making the other one and I got this so far and um, I don't like it. So um, I gotta start over. So I'm gonna toss that to the side. For right now I'm gonna clean up. I kinda got a mess here. And then I'm gonna start building the other wing. I got some wings on it now, and I found a few pieces. I might use this for the back. And I got kind of like a couple of things here. I'm gonna put this gear and hang it right in the center here. 
to kind of fill in this area. And then I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna um, make some sort of a head. And then I'm thinking about cutting this down and putting it over here. And it'll be kind of like the mouth of this creature. That's what I'm gonna try doing. I also have some mesh here that I'm gonna put on the wings. And I'm gonna cut that and just kind of bend it around. I found some eyes. I got the eyeballs and I kind of got the head. I was gonna make some sort of eyebrow or a cover for the finish the top. And uh, I found this piece. I'm thinking about maybe this or somehow, you know. So I haven't decided on that. But anyways, I got some welding to do. I think I like the eyeballs. Them are the start of them. I'm gonna do something else on the inside yet. Possibly um, some glass. I'm not sure yet. I got these teeth and I like the bottom. This one broke off. I gotta finish welding this back on. But I, I don't like these two. Um, so I'm gonna try to cut them off. And then I'm thinking about putting two more like fang type things like this down. I think it'll look a lot better than, um, cause the way I got it here with, there's too many wrenches. So that's it, and then I'm gonna do something with the tail. I'm hoping I finish pretty soon, but I'm gonna have at her. Okay, here we are again with my creation here. I gotta finish the other eyeball. I put this glass in here and then I wired this piece on which I had for a long time sitting up there and I think they look kind of neat. I found these little lights. I might try to put a light in there to light the eyeballs up and that would be kind of cool. But um, I finished the, the mouth type thing so that's all done i got the wings all done those are ready to go i don't think i'm gonna add much to them yet i found this chain and this is a piece that's uh from a digger that's gonna be like the tail the other day i found this chain at um swap meet and i liked them and i gonna put them on i have another one that i'm gonna put on this side and that's gonna kind of be like a back or the shoulders. Then I think I'm pretty much done with it other than uh, I'd like to put like some sort of claws on these feet. I think I'm gonna use what uh, railroad spikes and put like five claws on each one of them. Right now I got some grinding to do. I finished welding the back and like the shoulders, all of this is done welding. And uh, thought I was done with the back, but I kind of think it'd look better if the tail was longer. I found another one of these, and I think I'm gonna cut the bolts off and then kind of attach it somehow. Then <laughs> hopefully I'm, I'm done with the back. I think a longer tail would be uh, more proportionate to uh, whatever this thing is. <laughs> What I got going on is I got a couple of pieces that I'm gonna put on. I'm gonna put like this on, kind of like this, like an eyebrow type thing. Now I got these spikes cleaned up. I got a bunch more to do and then I gotta bend some. But I'm gonna start installing these to make some sort of claws. After I'm done, I might cut some of this um, excess stuff off. That's what I'm doing. Okay, this thing's pretty much done. Uh, 
All I got to do is I got the back claw, I got the railroad ties on there, I bent some of them, and I got to do this. Yeah, I got them ready to go, I just got a little clean up, then it's done. Then it's going to be getting it out of here. That's going to be a chore too. So my dad didn't film an outro or beauty shots of his creation, but here's some footage I collected for Junkin. As I mentioned before, the documentary will be released soon, in mid-February. So be on the lookout for that and don't forget to like, subscribe, and let my dad know what you think of his artwork in the comment section below.